Hey everybody, this is the Mind Catcher, and if you're interested in how I got this nice holiday look, keep watching. Around my eye, I just have some translucent powder because I already did my foundation and everything, so I just put a little powder down here to catch the fallout from the eyeshadow. We're going to start off with our primer. I already put my primer on my eye. You can use any eye primer you of your choice. Next, I'm going to go ahead and apply my concealer, and I'm using the Pro Concealer, LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Toast. And I'm just going to apply that to my lid and bottom lash line. Just going to even out my skin tone. Okay, guys, I'm going to start off with my transition color, and today I'm using Saddle by MAC just a brown color that's it right there on the brush this is the 217 blending brush by Mac I'm just going to apply that right there in the transition area and you can see it's just about my skin tone maybe a little bit darker Next, I'm going to go into my Coastal Scents Warm Palette. There's a plummy shade right here in the Warm Palette for Coastal Scents. I'm going to use that color as my crease color. So I'm going to dip a little bit into that same brush. That's what it looks like on the brush. I'm going to start placing that right here in the outer corner and working it in. And kind of blending it right there with the transition color. Next, I'm going to go ahead and use this uh, pigment. This is by NYX. It's called Nude Pearl. And I hope you guys can see that pretty clearly. Very pretty color. I'm just going to spray my shader brush a little bit. And I'm using the uh, Max Fix Plus. You can use water or eye drops, anything like that. Just gonna spray it and I dip it into the um, pigment and I'm just gonna place that right on the lid, okay? So I'm gonna close this eye and all that Fix Plus did was just intensify the color. Okay, next I'm going to go back to my blending brush and there's a color in the warm palette right here, a bronzy color. I'm going to use that right in the outer corner and kind of sweep it in towards that uh, nude pearl. So I'm going to start it out here and just start blending towards the nude pearl. Okay, and I'm going to go around the color and just start carving out a crease with that bronze color. Okay, next, there, there is a very, very good black in this palette. It's a matte black. I'm going to use that right in the outer corner and sweep that towards the brown color. go ahead and follow my eye shape right around very lightly you will see the black you're dragging some of the black inwards but very lightly we're carving out that crease using the black okay I'm also going to take a little bit of that black and run it on the bottom lash line right here in the corner Okay, here in the warm palette we have a nice beige color right here. It's also a matte color right there. I'm going to use that as my brow bone highlight. So I'm going to tap it to that color and tap it right here in the highest point of the brow. Right there. Kind of tap it on the tail here and just pull it down.
Okay, we're going back to our little trusty 217 blending brush. We're going to go back into that plummy color here. We're going to start blending that highlight color into the transition and crease colors. Okay, so very lightly, barely any on the brush. And I'm just going to start blending those colors together. Okay, for the bottom lash line, I'm going to use this angled brush. This is from RC Cosmetics. Looks like that. I'm going to spray it just a little bit. And I'm going to use the color Beauty Marked by MAC. And this is what Beauty Mark looks like. Kind of sparkly. Uh, has a little burgundy or plum in it. But um, to me, it really doesn't show up that well. You're, you're going to basically just see the sparkles and a little bit of black. So I'm going to go ahead and add that to the bottom lash line. Okay, I'm going to take that same brush and lightly dip into the Nude Pearl Pigment from NYX and kind of mix those two together. Okay, we're going to go ahead and add our gel liner and this is our Ruby Kisses Gel Liner in Rich Black. And I'm just going to apply a small wing. Okay guys, and this is what we're looking like. And if you don't like lashes, you can go ahead and start cleaning up your eye. But I'm going to go ahead and add these lashes here. Not really sure what name brand them they are, but I got these from the um, beauty supply store. Very natural, pretty lash. So I'm going to go ahead and apply those with the Dark Tone Duo. And I'll be right back with the completed face. And this is your completed look. And I thank you guys for tuning in to me today. Uh, on my lips, I'm wearing the same dark brown uh, liner I used on my eyebrows, which is Ruby Kisses Dark Brown Liner. Um, I was using the black for my uh, waterline. And I used the, well, it's called Black Brown. Okay. And it looks like that. And let me give you a quick swatch of it because I really, really like it for my eyebrows. So if you're looking for something for your eyebrows, I think this will be it. So very pretty. I like it. And for my lips, uh, I use a gloss from NYX. It's called Desert. Okay. Looks like that. And let me give you a swatch of that. Okay, there it is. Okay, so that's all I have on my lips right now. Very, very pretty. Okay. Like it. And I'm going to give you another option for the lips. Hold on one second. I'm gonna... Okay, guys, and this is the exact same look with a different lip color. This is Milani's Berry Rich. Uh, that's number 32 and I departed it and it looks like that okay so you can decide which lip you want uh, the neutral or the berry lip I think that this look is absolutely fabulous it's enough neutral to be worn kinda you know anywhere but it's enough sparkle to be worn for holidays or for a party or something like that. So I think it's absolutely perfect. And um, to me, I really like the berry lip better than the neutral lip. But it's all up to you. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. I hope it was something that you feel like you can try for yourself or recreate. 
and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cyber kisses. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye.